All right, hello, hello. We're now back at BT, doing another episode of Trail Logs. It's been a while since I've, uh, it's been a while since I've been back at BT and on a bike, um, because I have been traveling for work. And, uh, and then in the meantime, I also got COVID. So yeah, that was not fun. Um, but that kind of put me off the bike for at least two and a half weeks. So I haven't been back since. But now I'm back to 100% health. So uh, this is my first ride for a while. And this is also the first time that I'm bringing the, my new set of tires out on the trail. So if you haven't watched my previous episode, I uh, swapped out my tires, I took out my Maxxis, and now I'm on a pair of uh, Michelins, specifically uh, Wild Enduros, the front and the back set. So uh, it's my first time. So we'll see how it goes and how it rides on BT. Oh yeah. Hey. Onwards to the cliffhanger. So let's go. Oh, very nice. Uh, if you feel the, the knobs on the wheels, you can actually feel the difference on how they compress. So, they tend to be a bit softer, so they should be able to dig into the ground a little bit better. Obviously, at the expense of uh, the longevity of the tyre. It had went out, wear out a little bit faster than Maxis. All right, coming up the squeaky uh, tires are holding up pretty well. No complaints so far. Just a little bit of statistics. Um, so both front and rear tires are at 2.4 inches high width. Uh, slightly different from what I had before. So I was running 2.5 up front and 2.3 at the back. So uh, it kind of evens it out a little bit. So 2.4 front and rear. Whoa. All right, here we go to the double drop. and easy the middle to jump oh nice <laughs> pretty nice and flat landing if I may say so myself and uh, looking at my front fork travel indicator I've pretty much used up all my 160 millimeters of travel wow very nice, very nice. Today's terrain is fantastic. All right, now we come to the climbing section. So let's see 
how well these wheels can climb. Sweat the wheels a little bit. Oh yeah. The only issue I face when climbing is uh, really traction more than anything else. My rear wheel tends to spin quite a lot, especially when you're just pushing down on the pedals really hard. Okay, here's the second part of the climb. Let's see how well you grip. Oh, oh, hello. Very nice. Very little effort on my part. Oh, very nice. All right, here we go, speed. On pedaling. Pedal, 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 pedal. Look ahead. There we go. All right. The Singapore quarry. Downhill, sit down, lean back. Let's go. Woo! Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Wow. Very janky. Super janky. Gently. Let's go. Lean in, break, and move. The softer tires definitely has its benefits. Obviously, you lose a little bit of speed when you're going out in the, um, on the downhills and on the flats. But when you're climbing, oh my god, it, the, the, the knobs just dig in. Especially on a terrain like this, on a day like this, very nice. Lung Buster. Just lean forward. And you'll be fine. Put all your weight to the front. And just pedal at a steady pace. Can definitely feel that I don't have the stamina. 
after two weeks of non-riding just goes down the drain yes oh legs are burning oh. Whoa! Woo. Slow down, slow down. Okay. We gotta shift up. I feel the Michelins are not as fast rolling as uh, the Maxis for obvious reasons. Um, there is a little bit more resistance when you're um, pedaling at the top range. You can just feel that something's holding you back a little bit. But I mean, it's not much of a difference. But at the end of the day, you're on the trail you can't really travel that fast anyway it's all good I'm happy to give up some of that rolling speed for a little bit more grip as we shall see in a few moments time on Stairway to Heaven whoa -ho -ho. that's not a good start that's uh you can edit that out neither is this But here is the moment that I really want to nail these new tyres. So let's see. Terrain is good. There's no excuse. Let's go. Oh yes, 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 oh, yes. Okay, that's not bad. I did spin a little bit right there at the top but it's a good thing I managed to get it all back all right finish this up all right done Whew. Give me a moment, let me catch my breath. Now I'm back and uh, onwards to the exit. Okay, so summary of today's ride. Uh, overall, it's really, really nice. Terrain is nice, the weather is nice. Nothing to complain about. I'm really glad that uh, I came out here today at this time. Also with these new pair of Michelins while in Duros. Uh, couldn't have asked for a better ride. The grip is absolutely phenomenal. Uh, you can definitely feel it dig in when you're climbing up. Uh, right there at uh, Beluka and then of course Stairway to Heaven. I did lose a little bit of grip but mainly because I guess it's just me and the way I ride. But nonetheless it helped me get up the climb uh, in one shot so that's always a good thing uh, of course being softer tires they don't roll as quick but uh, I, I think it's fine I'm okay with that so overall these new Michelins absolutely an absolutely recommended upgrade so if you're looking for looking for new tires um, and you just want to change out a Maxxis uh, do try Michelin. Michelin's are uh, available at uh, my favorite bike store, Unsprung, located over at Hindheat Road. So uh, if you're free, just pop down and have a look and uh, let's see what you can get. All right, here we go onwards to the exit. Woo! Woo! 
Dangerous. Dangerous. That's it for another episode of Trail Logs at BT. Thank you so much for watching. And until the next video, ride safe. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.